What's it like to taste Scotland's favourite lager? Let's find out. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Shane's Craft Beer Review. We have another viewer suggested beer today. Uh, this was suggested by my very good friend Sheldon, who unfortunately I don't get to see as often as I should. So Sheldon, thank you for the beer. Uh, well, the suggestion anyway. Uh, this is the Tenants 1885 Lager. This is by the Tenants Caledonian Brewing Company out of Glasgow, Scotland. 5% alcohol by volume. And again, this is one of those beers that I cannot find the IBU on no matter how hard I look. So let's just say 10, just for, for shits and giggles. Uh, 473 milliliter can, only $2.75. Based on a historic export recipe, this lager pour is clear, clear yellow with a medium white head. The nose offers aroma of cereal, citrus, grass, and corn, while the palate offers similar flavors uh, and moderate, 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 can't even talk today, moderate, 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 moderate carbonation on a light, crisp, and refreshing palate. An, an excellent ambassador, this is Scotland's favorite lager. Okay, so apparently this is Scotland's favorite lager. We'll find out uh, how a Canadian boy uh, thinks of it. All right. So let's pour this out here. Well, they weren't lying. It is a clear yellow color, that's for sure. I guess that's what we call it. What do they call that? A medium white head? Yeah, it's pretty decent. That's not too bad. Pretty clear, though, as you guys can see. Nice and clear looking. Uh, definitely getting some malt. Maybe, maybe a touch. I'm not getting any grass in this at all. It smells like a it smells like a lager. All right, let's try it out. Cheers. It's not bad. Um, definitely light. Uh, getting a little bit of a malt flavor in there. Not too sweet, though. Um, you do get a little bit of a cereal kind of flavor to it. Um, it it's, it's not too bad. Yeah, it's, it's, it's definitely light tasting. Um, crisp, a little on the dry side, but not terrible. Um... I've had better lagers, to be honest. Sorry, Sheldon. Um, on a scale of one to five, I'm only going to give this probably about a three. Um, it's it's not bad. I, I mean, I'll definitely drink it again, but not. it's not fantastic. I don't know why the people in Scotland think this is their favorite lager. I'm sure they have better lagers than this. Because I know them Scottish people can make a good beer. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks, Sheldon, for the suggestion. See you guys all next time.